development of science in Mesoamerica. Mesoamerica, which comes from the Greek and means Middle America, is a geographical and cultural area that stretches from central Mexico down through Central America, including the territory that is now Guatemala, Belize, Honduras, and El Salvador. As a result, it is considered to be partially in North America and partly in Central America. There were three ancient civilizations that flourished in what is known as Central and South America. These civilizations were the Inca, the Maya, and the Aztecs. Because they placed such a high priority on education, all three of these people were able to accomplish remarkable achievements in the fields of engineering and science. Education was given a great deal of importance in Aztec, Maya, and Inca society. Education had to be a top concern for these people since civilizations relied on very bright, brilliant philosophers and engineers. The Mesoamericans were the earliest polymer scientists. They do not know how to process the sap of local rubber trees, but they had perfected a system of chemical processes by which they could adjust the properties of rubber based on its intended of use. For soles for their sandals, for bands and adhesive discs, for the attachment of blades to the shafts, for balls for their ball game and etc. They produce rubber optimized for resistance and strength. The Mayan civilization was one of Mesoamerica's most powerful indigenous societies. They excelled at agriculture by showing modern farming techniques, including irrigation and therapy, prolific writing, calendar making, such as complex calendars, as the calendar round, which is based on 365 days, and the long crown calendar, which is planned to span over 5,000 years and mathematics like the use of zero and left an incredible amount of spectacular building and symbolic artwork in their trail, which maintained their reputation as Mesoamerica's greatest artists. Inca Civilization The Inca Empire was a fascinating civilization. They were able to build massive stone buildings and a variety of bridges, including suspension and pantoon, that survived hundreds of years despite, despite frequent earthquakes by tightly fitting the stones and other architect architectural techniques. They grow crops in many kinds of terrain using irrigation and water storage techniques. They were quite efficient despite not having enough tools. They established their calendar by studying the sun and stars, which is made up of 12 months that consist of 3 weeks and 10 days. The Inca would add a day or two to the calendar and the sun to bring them back into line. Aztec Civilization it is another Mesoamerican that flourished in central Mexico that has huge contributions to the development of science, which includes the following. Chinampas. Long elevated plant beds were placed on the shallow lake bed. They were very, a very efficient agricultural system capable of producing seven crops per year. Medical. Physicians knew how to treat illnesses and how to prevent them. They could, for example, cure fevers, fractured bones, colds, and earaches. Even procedures for pregnant women were available from them. Tools and tools, dried obsidian stone and copper were employed instead of common materials for their weapons and tools. Makuaho tail, which resembles a baseball bat, and tiat flats, which are spear throwers. Calendars, they are using two calendars, the divine calendar, which consists of 260 days, while the ordinary calendar consists of 360 days. 65 days. And that's the end of presentation. Thank you.